Uh, let's make an aeropress today and uh, we'll be using pineapple fermented beans for that. These are South Indian beans and are medium roast. What we'll do is we'll take 18 grams of pineapple fermented beans. Yeah. And we'll grind them at a size of 5. Okay, so our beans are ready for our aeropress. So this is basically what is called an aeropress. There are numbers written here. You can read 1, 2, 3, 4. I'll tell you later about this. So what we'll do is uh, we have. Okay, so the water is getting heated. So what we'll take do is uh, take our coffee and put it into our aeropress. I'll show you. Uh, this is These are two parts of aeropress. There is a stopper here, it's a rubber thing, so you have to put it from this side, okay, yeah, it will create like a vacuum, so now what we will do is put our coffee into uh, the aerobrass, okay, so uh, make sure the coffee is evenly spread out in the aerobrass and uh, this is a weighing scale. Now what we'll do is, uh, once our water is ready, we'll start pouring. This 1, 2, 3, 4, what's written on your aeropress is very important. As we'll pour it in 4 parts. Like, see the water is ready. Now what I'll do is, uh, wet the filter. As you can see, it's done now. now. We'll keep it aside for a while. And we'll start our weighing machine weighing scale and uh, we'll put till water till the number 4 okay okay first pour is of 30 ml yeah. now it's time for our second pour and we'll Go till the number 2 now. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, Aeropress is a type of manual coffee brewing. This is better than our old machines as uh, these are fresh coffee. It has more aroma and more taste and less acidic than the espressos. It's time for a third pour. We'll do this one more time and then we'll transfer our filter over the aeropress. It usually takes 2.5 minutes to complete this process. So let's start our final pour. Now what we have to do is this uh, we'll put this cap over our aeropress and lock it. Now uh, as it's a hot aeropress order, what we'll do is okay. Notice this very carefully how it's done. 
we will take a glass in which we have to serve our coffee. We will put it here. Switch it upside down. Okay. So uh, make sure that you use a strong glass under it because with the press it has to be a very strong and a good quality glass so that it can take the pressure we put. So now as the time is over for this and the coffee is ready. Now what I'll do is I'll show you how to press it. So the press has been completed and our coffee is ready. Now what we will do is remove our AeroPress and a freshly brewed coffee is ready. Now uh, we can do a lot of variations in that like if you want to uh, decrease the acidity, acidic nature of coffee even further you can just add 10 or 15 ml of milk in this. I will just show you and show you the texture what happens while we do that. So this is our AeroPress we just made and this is a splash of milk. So please focus on the texture. I will just do pour it over this. What this does is reduces the acidic nature of coffee and tastes really okay. So it's ready to go.